No, absolutely not. He runs around in every single direction and he thinks that he can bark at dogs like five times his size. He has no idea what he's doing, not street smart at all. He knows not to speak to strangers, so he's trying to get away from the interview. <laughs> she is really street smart. She's better on the street than she is at, at home. She originally, we think, was stray, so she doesn't really stop for cars, I guess. But, <laughs> but she, she uh, knows how to work her way down Fifth Avenue. The only thing that Sam is not street smart about is that she likes to eat every little piece of trash on the street, so I'm constantly pulling it out of her mouth. So, anybody out there who's leaving chicken bones on the street, you're causing poor little Sam bodily harm. Fairly street smart, yeah. He knows to get out of people's way when he's walking. That's really about it. The tougher dogs he'll kind of scoot away from. He has a good sense about him. Are you street smart? <laughs> Maybe not her. <laughs> She's more interested in the squirrels behind us. Yeah, Rocky's street smart. Yeah. Uh huh. He, Rocky knows. Rocky knows the deal. He he knows what's going on. Well, it's the first time in the street. He's coming from a breeder in upstate New York. Just picked him up, and first time in New York City. He's very aware all the time, especially in the city. It surprises me. He knows when to stop at the corner when cars are coming. <laughs> he loves to jaywalk. <laughs> He ran into a tree a few months ago and got a little crack in his legs, so I would say definitely not. She's absolutely street smart. She knows her way around New York. She's got her street smarts going on. She's bi-coastal. She loves California as well. She's a jet setter, but New York is her hometown and she loves it.